Well, we don't always hit every green. Sometimes you get this. Plug lies. Beauty right there. You hate them. Everybody hates them. Everybody hates them. Why don't we go around and you can talk us through what you guys yeah, do to make this an easy shot. Do you have any chance of getting this close to the hole or are you just thinking, get it out? So for me, when I get a lie like this, I'm really just looking at trying to limit the damage. Pretty much play like a normal bunker shot, except I try and almost feel like I'm I'm using the heel of the club like to dig into the back of the ball or you really need to hit this hard. You know, you kind of not be afraid to kind of chop down into the back of it. That's as good as you can hope for. Really. Nice big deep divot though. The heels cup the sand. Plenty of depth there. And, and you got to play with a lot of speed like, like Shane said. It's not ideal and there's certain situations you get yourself in on the golf course where you need to limit the damage and play a bit safer and this is one of them. Graham, why don't you talk us through how you're going to get this out and hopefully get it close. Yeah, I'm not a big close face guy or a square club face guy. I'm a little like Shane. I like to try and lower the handle so that I'm kind of activating you know, more of the heel of the club. The heel typically has a little less bounce. So as we get low with the handle, wide with the stance and really get that handle in low. Because it does two things. It makes that head go up in the air, get vertical, but it also helps the heel of that club kind of do the do that digging that we need to make that ball kind of pop up. Oh. oh, hello. I would say that that was a better lie than I had. Yeah, that was a better lie, but he would well, say he that, put that, it though. in there. He, he would say that, though. He's only Ireland's most competitive man. Oh, oh better. 90% of hitting this shot effectively is about setup and, and making sure you have a setup that is going to create the type of loft and the type of strike that you're looking for out of a bunker. If you have a correct setup, you're a, a long way to hitting good shots. See your local pro and get a good setup, and as long as your like alignment, your ball position, your posture, everything is correct. I mean, you've got a good chance of hitting a decent shot then. Clearly, GMAC, you win that skills challenge there with that <laughs> shot. But you're the mo you're the older, <laughs> more veteran guy, I, I, and you gave yourself a better lie. Well. According to Larry, my <laughs> lie was better. <laughs> Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> well, that's how you do it. Plug lies. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, Shane. Thanks, thanks, thanks Graham. That yeah, was good. Thanks, thanks guys. Jake.